Hey guys, how's it going? I want to do a quick little vlog video for you today. Just to talk to you about a few things to do with the business. As you can see here, shipping out um, some boxes to FBA. It's Monday, so I'm really busy. Things are going crazy. I'm just, just dealing with all this right here. Putting this stuff away. And um, I've also got my eBay stuff that sold over the weekend. And that's in there. And uh, let's see, I got uh, five packages total. So let me just sit down over here or I'm trying to get away from the sun. It's, you know, I was, I was begging for some sun a few days ago and now it's uh, crazy. Whew. Yeah. So, um, anyway, I got uh, five packages going out. I've got two suits that are a hundred each and, um, three sport coats that are 50 each. Now the cost to ship each of them, let's see, it was, um, like 560 for the, uh, for the sport coats cause I've been putting them in padded flat red envelopes. I've got a, a little tip that I can share with you guys that'll hopefully save you guys some time. Uh, basically, it makes it really easy to get any sport coat into a padded flat rate envelope for the most part. If it's like a, a real serious tweed, forget about it. Um, or like a, those camel hair ones are pretty crazy. But um, for the most part, you get them in a padded flat rate envelope and um, that certainly helps a lot if you're shipping internationally also in many cases. But the thing I wanted to talk to you guys today about was um, just being persistent and getting out there and going and uh, you know doing the things that you have to do to keep your business going and for me that involves going out and getting more books getting more clothing and just just hitting the road you know I have not been out uh, as much as as much as I'd like to and that's changing now now it's time to get out there it's time to go crush it as I said in the video before um, it's like a, a light switch you know it's time to go so uh, the book sales are full swing now it's going crazy Lots of opportunities out there for everyone, so hopefully uh, you're going to lots of book sales and having lots of fun and finding lots of cool stuff and going to tag sales, yard sales, flea markets, all that good stuff. But the thing I wanted to ask you guys today was, as you can see, I'm shipping out those five things for eBay, and I'm dealing with all these smalls for, for Amazon. Um, what do you think is the best business for someone who does not have any employees? Do you think it's better to focus on the, the big items, like let's let's just say $50 and up, you're selling only items that are like $50 and up, or is it better as a one-person business to sell all the little smalls where you're selling, you know, things like uh, ties on eBay for 10 bucks? Is that a better business model? Do you think there's more success in that, or do you think it just kind of depends? Because I find um, I've been gravitating more towards the, the bigger items. Um, Amazon FBA is really the only reason I'm selling so many small items, you know, for uh, 10 bucks and under. But... Uh, yeah, it's been really, uh, really a fantastic weekend. Had some relaxing time. Had some had some time with the family. Uh, spent some time at my at uh, at Rachel's parents' place. So that was good. Um, yeah, life is good. You know, it's just so important to just um, to stay positive and stay motivated. And uh, that's one of the things I've really been working on this year, and it's made such a big difference in my life. And um, that's really all I wanted to talk about today. Just to come at you guys with a quick little video here to talk to you guys about a few things like that. Show you guys what it's like on Monday. I'm freaking crazy. I, I got to get going. I'm a little bit late. Um, I'm going to have to hustle like a maniac until uh, 10 o'clock tonight because I, I did get a late start to the day. Had to bring Rachel over um, to work. So I'm just a little bit out of it today. But that's, you know, for me what it comes down to is you just got to be persistent and you got to stay motivated and you got to just keep going because uh, I'm really trying to make this year better than last year and I want it to be my best year ever and that's just not gonna happen unless you got the pedal to the metal so <laughs> so that's the goal that's what I'm working on that's what I'm gonna try to do I'm really excited and um, I hope you are too if you do like this video please be sure to let me know what you think in the comments down below give me a thumbs up share this video and make sure if you haven't already go to onlinesellerforum.com I think you'll enjoy that quite a bit so, with that being said, guys, hopefully you're enjoying spring. Get out there and enjoy the sunshine a little bit. That's what I did this weekend. All right, guys, i got to bring over my Amazon FBA shipment and uh, drop off my eBay stuff and get out there and go sourcing. This is what it takes. This is what this business takes. It's not just sitting around, um, messing around, farting around on YouTube. Um, you got to get out there and you got to put in the time and you got to make things happen. So, that being said, I'll talk to you guys later.